Hey guys, I'm back in the same filming spot um, in my last video you saw, so I'm not going to explain, so if you want to watch that, um, so I'm here with my February, no February, my March Glim Box, so I'm going to open it up. I think Glim is my favorite box that I subscribe to right now, um, but to unbox this box to get into the second box is just a pain in the butt and I hate doing it so hold on for a minute okay my March box is here same as always I will open it up and show you what's inside hopefully I don't mess it up um, okay Look away because I think it's going to fall out. <clears throat> that's what's inside. Oh no, wait. That's what's inside. <laughs> okay. Whoa, crazy. Oh, how cute. <laughs> A feather extension. That's really different. Wow. How nice. That's so cute. Um, separate hair into a small section. Comb out and heat the thing. Oh, it's like a shoelace. Weird. Or like this, the end is like a shoelace. So it's kind of a green teal color with like black little bits going through it. Um, that is so cute. Oh, and there's the loops right there. So does that mean it's going to stay in here for like ever? I don't want it to, but there's three little pieces. To secure it, you have to use extension pliers to clamp the micro ring onto the hair shaft. Um, neat. So I'll probably give that a try. Maybe. We'll see. That's really, that's really different and neat. Alright, the next thing... Whoa. <gasps> Anastasia! Sweet! I love their stuff. Um, I have stickers left on my hand. Hold on. Ew. Anastasia, I don't know what it is. It's a gloss? A lip gloss by Anastasia. Oh, they're tiny. So tiny. Um, oh, it's a different color, too. I like the packaging. It's like a, um, a nice wearable, I guess, neutral color. Can't really go into it. Maybe I'll take pictures and show you guys on my blog. In the color... Moi, like French for me. So, I really like that. What? Two of them? Are you serious? <laughs> oh, that is so awesome. There's two samples in there. Um, it's one milliliter, so it's super tiny, but I have two of them. It's sweet. Okay, my next thing is, okay, can I close this? Next thing is a cherry red, kind of with sparkly, it's called Russian Red by Ocean, whoever they are. So, I don't wear bright colors on my fingers, but I um, save those for my toes and everything. <clears throat> and I could wear this. I think I like it. But red makes me think of like old women. Um, I mean, not to say that that's a bad thing, but whatever. I like this. The next thing I got is, uh, it's all in French. It's an instant facial energizer. But it comes in this little glass bottle, I think, just like the Lee Swatch A one we got a few months ago. Um, I'm kind of afraid to break the glass bottles because I don't want tiny little invisible shards to go into the liquid. So, if anybody's ever used, like, one of these glass little vials before, can you let me know how you do it without getting tiny bits of glass into your product? I mean, maybe it's easy, but I'm kind of afraid to try it out. But I do like serums for your face because I find that they're very moisturizing. The next and final product is... Whoa, I don't know what this is. Why is it brown? 
It's like a super dark brown. Is that like... Hold on. I'll have to read the um, thing. It says... What? So it says it evens complex complexion and controls shine. Directions. Apply uh, onto the entire face until desired coverage is obtained. But I mean, look how dark it is. Holy Moses. Let me see. Weird. It kind of blends in. It's kind of a bit too tan for my... For, um myself, but when I use my self tanner, it might be okay. Whoa, it blends in. Weird. Maybe it isn't too dark. Weird. This is super weird. Okay, so this says, um, This silky formula blends beautifully into your skin to conceal uneven skin tone for a light matte natural looking finish. It smooths away the appearance of wrinkles and large pores and imperfections to re reveal a sun-kissed healthy looking skin tone. It's magical. Crazy. That is so weird. It's by Massam. I don't know. That's crazy. That's a really interesting product. That's so weird. Do you put like foundation up on top? I don't know. Um, so again, Glim always surprises me with super neat products and oh my god, Anastasia. <laughs> Why do I always drop this? <clears throat> um, Anastasia products. Love their stuff. Um, I kind of want to try out their eyebrow pencils because a Sephora makeup artist tested it out on my eyebrows and it looked kind of good so maybe I'll start doing that but I'm not sure. We'll see. Might be too much work. Um, yeah, so that's my March Glimbox. I'm super happy with it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!